those who ask, why do Shia beat their chests? The Wahhabis have come forward and said that the Shia beat their chests out of guilt because it was the Shia who killed Imam Hussein alayhi salam. But this is nothing but a vicious lie. Yes, the people of Kufa did turn their backs on the Imam, but the true Shia either escaped Kufa and fought with the Imam or were imprisoned or killed on the orders of Ibn Ziyad and Yazid alayhi. The reason why we beat our chests is because this is the way of showing our intense grief over the tragedies of Ahlul Bayt When something is painful or alarming for our human being, it is natural for them to be extremely emotional. In the Holy Quran, Allah Subhanahu wa Ta'ala says about Sarah, the wife of Prophet Ibrahim salam, and his wife approached with a cry and struck her face and said, a barren old woman. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala did not reprimand Sarah alayhi salam here for showing this alarm and grief. And furthermore, even in the books of Ahl Sunnah, there are narrations which say that Aisha and the wives of the Holy Prophet sallallahu beat their chests and slapped their faces when they heard that the Holy Prophet had passed away. When the ladies of Ahlul Bayt alayhi salam saw what had become of the mutilated body of Imam al Hussein alayhi salam, they could not hold back their grief and wailing. When we do Latum, we remember this moment and we reflect on how the merciless army of Umar ibn Sa'ad alayhi, rode their horses over the chest of Imam Hussein alayhi salam, the chest to which the Holy Prophet alayhi wa alayhi, used to kiss and the chest that Zainab alayhi salam, was instructed by her mother Fatima Zahra alayhi salam, to kiss before he went out to fight. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala soothe the broken heart of Lady Fatima alayhi salam and help us to continue to teach the world about her son and his divine sacrifice. <laughs>